Hi everyone. Okay, I think this okay, it's recording now. Um on mine it takes a while to for it to start recording. Anyways, so I'm doing a really quick, well hopefully really quick, probably not oh my hair did there. Um collective haul video. This is about since Mother's Day I've been collecting this stuff. So I started filming it directly from YouTube and then it cut my video off and it was only like five minutes so far. I'm like, okay, that's not even that long. So it was five minutes and it cut me off and then started doing that previewing thing and that takes like half an hour and I'm like, uh, never mind, exit out of that and I'm just going to do it regular and then upload it and edit it and stuff. Um, maybe I won't edit it. Maybe I'll leave it like this. Um, I have no makeup on. It's my new thing. I'm not going to do my makeup. not going to do my hair. I'm just kidding. I was kind of lazy today. I don't have to be at work. So I decided to film a video and talk to you guys for a little bit. Um, and yeah. Oh, I'm doing the four week no heat challenge with um, Cosmetics. Charlotte 72, I think her name is. I'm really sorry if I butchered that. Um, it's either Cosmetics Charlotte 72 or Cosmetics by Charlotte, maybe. I think it's Cosmetics Charlotte 72. Anyways, I'm rambling. So, let's get in with my haul. I went to Marshalls first, and I've got this Rusk Sensories Wellness Heal Shampoo set. And it's shampoo, sorry, shampoo, conditioner right here. Ugh. The Wellness Drops and the Deep Conditioner. This was $19.99 and it was originally $48. This is supposed to be very um, healing and moisturizing for your hair. And my hair is really, really dry at the tips and damaged. So I'm looking forward to trying this out. And not to mention, I'm almost out of my um, L'Oreal one that I have. The It was in my Ulta haul. The sulfate-free one. I think this, this is natural, so I'm guessing it's sulfate-free. Hopefully. I'll look at the the ingredients to say anything about sulfate, but you never know. Um, and then I got this Chi Organics. I had no Chi made organic products. I was really happy when I saw that. And not to mention, I only got it for $7.99 and it was originally $16. I wouldn't pay $16. That's a, that's a ridiculous amount of money to spend on a little tube of deep conditioner. But that's what it looks like. And all my light just got blocked out so you can see this perfectly. That's crazy, right? Okay, anyways. I got that at Marshall's, so I'll do a review on that and let you know if it works really well because my hair is super, super dry, so if it, like, moisturizes my hair, I'll just leave it like that, then it's good. Oh, and then I'm going to be going, maybe, maybe not, to New Mexico soon for a wedding. How exciting. And anyways, it was a kind of a, you know, simple, casual wedding. Um, it's going to be in a church, obviously, so I do want to wear a dress. But there's going to be a reception afterwards. So, you know, I want to go slightly dressy. But it is New Mexico. We're in the middle of the desert. It's going to be super hot because it's going to be in June. And so I went to Charlotte Ruse and all the dresses were on sale. So I picked up this one. And it's super cute. It's white, cotton. And if you can tell, maybe, it has this really, oops, sorry, cute little, like, line detailing all the way down. I know my lighting is just going all psycho crazy right now. It's got the thick straps and this cute little sweetheart neckline. And then it's fitted here and here with a little bit of pleating and the little wooden buttons. And then it's got this cute little chunky belt that goes around it like that. And I got that at Charlotte Ruse. Oop. And then I got my Cosmo magazine or Cosmopolitan. It has Cameron Diaz on the front. Um, I got it because there was a pair of shoes in here that I saw and I was like, um, okay, I have to have those shoes. So I bought the magazines so I could take it with me, like, when I go to the mall. I love doing that. I take my magazines with, like, post-it notes and stuff in them so that I know exactly what I'm looking for so I don't get super distracted. Oh, here it is. They're at Macy's for $34 from Material Girl. Those right there. You see them? Those are so adorable. They're navy blue with like teal like leaves and pink and red roses on them. I don't know, they're very 90s looking, like 80s, 90s looking, but they're super adorable because they're modernized with a little wedge. And I love the little like ankle strap. Really super cute. And then I got Seventeen magazine. Yay. Um, because I saw an Ellen Blair that Blair posted um on there that she was in Seventeen magazine so I went and picked it up because I wanted I love Seventeen I had every single issue 
I might not just uh, renew my subscription, but whatever. Um. Anyway, she's in here for the beauty ten dollars or less, and she is right there, right with Etsy Brazilians on the other side. Ironic, but anyways, there she is. She's very pretty in there and I'm super excited to look up these products that she used and try them out and I love her idea of using a foundation brush to put your blush on that's a really good idea so anyways I have my 17 magazine and I got that and then I did wow. I went to Charlotte Ruth again and I got two pairs of sunglasses they were five dollars each. I got them at the um, Charlotte Ruth outlet, and I got these. They're like, I don't know, they're cat eye. They're like big cat eye glasses. I don't know. They look like that. You can see the side. How like they wing out a little bit. I thought they were really cute. So I got those, and then um, I know Fleur de Force or Fleur on YouTube and Blair G Star Seven have the Chanel sunglasses with the little bows on the side. And so I went to Nordstrom's and I went to the Chanel counter. I went to go see how much they were. They were a bit expensive. So I found these at Charlotte Ruse and I almost died because they were so cute. And they were really cute, like, I guess knockoff. But they don't have the little Chanel symbol on the side. So they're not, like, real knockoffs. So they're, like, imitation. And they're this big. They're nice and big. And look at the sides. They're red with the little bows. How adorable can you get with these? I mean... I love the fact that they were black and then the pop of red and the little bows on the side. So cute. And they were really big. I love big sunglasses. I just have a sunglass collection. I have so many pairs. It's an obsession. It's a wrong obsession, actually. Um, and then I went to um, the marketplace in my area. It's kind of like a flea market, but not really because they sell new stuff. I don't know. Um... Anyways, so it's actually called the Orange County Marketplace, um, and I go there, and people call it the swap meet, I call it the market, it's called the marketplace, but I've heard people call it the swap meet, um, and I picked up the CD, it was only a dollar, and it's by Mike Peralta, it's Music of My Youth, looks like that, and it was only a dollar, um, and, I don't know, I really liked his music, he was there live, and he had this little sign. It was so cute. It said, um, just, um, drop your change in. Get what you paid for. Don't worry, I trust you or something like that. It was, it's cool, I trust you. I thought it was so sweet. And it really shows, like, that he kind of believes people are genuinely good people. If obviously he trusts people to drop in their money and take their item and not drop in, like, you know, oh, I'm dropping in, like, $5 and getting, like, a bunch of items. And you're only dropping in, like, a dollar bill or something, you know? So I was super impressed with that, and I loved his voice. It was very soothing, so I picked up his CD to listen to. For a dollar, I, you really couldn't go wrong. And I love supporting, like, musicians and stuff. I think that's really cool. I love watching people sing on YouTube, like, especially if, like, they have a good voice and they seem really genuine about it, and their videos aren't just, this is my song. Or, you know, they have a little personality with their music. I really like that. So I love watching people. So if you have a music channel, um, link it in the bottom bar below, and I would love to check it out. Anyways, going on, I went to Walgreens where I picked up my magazines, and I bought a little EOS lip balm. I have the summer fruit one, and I picked up this one. It's sweet mint. Okay, well, that just kind of blinded you. Okay, I don't know how, I don't know what that does, but obviously it blocks light, so you can see it a little bit better. Sweet mint. Oh, there it goes. And it's this really cute little teal color. And I love them. They look like little eggs. Look at Um, anyways, I have this the summer fruit one and now I got this one. And this was $3.79. They're cheaper at Target. I'm just saying. They're cheaper at Target. Um, and then I went to Bath and Body Works and I picked up this little thing. Oh, you can see my computer. Um, it's Country Chic, their new scent. And it was $15 and you get this adorable little lotion that and then you get the little mini perfume let's block the light maybe you could see that I don't know. this is country chic on it 
<laughs> okay, that's funny. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, country chic. Um, I got it because I like the bottle. I like the little flower bottle, and I love the fact that it said country chic. I thought that was really cute. It smells like um, it smells like dryer sheets. So when I'm walking, I'm like, oh, who's doing laundry? It's me. I mean, it's not like a bad scent, but it's clean, I guess. Maybe. Um, anyway, oh my gosh. And then I'm trying to exercise more and just kind of get fit. Let me put all my junk away. So I was, I went at, when I was at Target, I picked up a jump rope. Uh, it's a speed jump rope from Embark. It's a Target brand. It's nice, it's like bright green with like the little cushion handles. I don't know. Um, in here, in here the, the workout guru guy that they have. What's his name? Harley Pasternak. He says that a jump rope is Katy Perry's secret weapon. No matter where she is on tour backstage, she uses it to squeeze in some cardio. So, anyways, I heard before, I read in here, that Katy Perry uses the jump rope because it was in another Seventeen magazine that I had. And so I was like, well, Katy Perry is super fit. Like, she's got a rocking body. And I really don't care for running that often. I don't run around my neighborhood unless I have a creepy neighbor. So I thought a jump rope would be good to, you know, work in the house. And then, I'm almost done, I promise. Okay. So I'm going to show you some of the other things I got at the Orange County Marketplace when I went. Um, if you're looking for reasonably, reasonably priced, cheap OPI nail polish, go there. These were only $6.49. I was blown away. I went a little crazy. I got Hopelessly in Love, which is this... Well, the, the color is blowing it out funny, but it's like a baby pink. And then my mom actually picked up Privacy Please, which is like another baby pink color. But this is more of a light pink, and this is more of like a dusty pink, I guess. Um, but she really didn't like the way it went on. I thought they were nice. I like nude, simple colors because I can't wear crazy bright colors for work. But then I had to pick up one color color, and I like a color that's not nude. Like that wash up, and I got Gargantuan Green Grape. No, maybe not. Anyways, that's how it looks. The color is like a mint green. This is not showing up well on camera. But it's a mint green. Um, and it'll go, this is the color of my cowboy boots. Like the tips, and then they're tan brown, and I have a matching bag. So if you go and pick up, or even just look at gar gargantuan green grape, those are the color of my cowboy boots. Because this is blowing it out funny. And then, I... Like, I'm obsessed with these little tumbler cups. I think they're super cute. And I got this one, and it was $7. And it has cupcakes all around it. Isn't that cute? And it's got a little plastic straw. It's from that Eco on the Go cup brand. I don't know. They make some really cute tumblers, like, with really fun patterns. But I like the cupcake one, and I had to have it, so I picked that up. And then this is from my cousin, because it was my birthday. April 30th, so she bought me some stuff, and I, I just recently got it from her because I don't see her that often. But anyway, she picked me up this really cute little black, little like longish sweater with a little pocket in the front, and it cuts out right here. Um, so it was really cute. It's nice and comfy. And then she got me this little necklace that I'm totally gonna wear with it. It's an owl necklace, little black beaded eyes. I'm super excited. I love owls. So when she asked if I had it, I was like, no, do not have that. And then she got me this really adorable Hello Kitty watch. It's pink. It looks super fancy. You know, I'm like, oh my gosh. So I wear it to work and I, I get some compliments on it. So I thought it was really cute. And then, as I say, the piece de resistance of this whole entire haul are these earrings that she got me. Yes. Hostess cupcake earrings. Hostess cupcake earrings. They're so cute. Because she'd ask me if I had some. I have some Tipsy Roll ones. And I have some Gummy Bear ones. I have some really funky earrings. Maybe I'll do an earring haul. An earring haul. An earring collection. Um, but they're dangly. And let's see if I can get them on. And that's how they look on. 
super cute. Look at that. The little cupcakes. Um, so I'm sure that'd be a really fun conversation starter with somebody. Yay! You have hosts cupcake earrings on. I know my Tootsie Roll earrings and my gummy bear earrings were a conversation starter with boys, so. Bunk earrings. <laughs> Up until a certain age, I'm sure. I'm 21, so I think I might still be able to get away with wearing these every now and then. But that is everything from my haul. And now we're at 15 minutes, so if you're still with me at this point in the video, thank you very much. Um, and as I said, I will be doing reviews on those conditioners and shampoos that I picked up. And I hope you guys have a great day, and I will talk to you later. Bye! Thank you for watching!